Assalamualaikum and hi everyone I'm teacher Aida here Today we are going to continue on this topic Mixture Hello and welcome back to my science class Alright Today this is what we That you have to learn okay, Materials that dissolve more quickly Okay Dissolve, larut more quickly dengan cepat. Okay, our first investigation: Which water can dissolve sugar more quickly? Okay, is it in hot water or in cold water? Which water can dissolve sugar more quickly? Okay, air yang manakah yang dapat melarutkan Gula dengan cepat Is it in hot water or in cold water? Now let's be investigate Okay, investigating The solubility of sugar In hot and cold water Alright Pour the same amount of water In glass A And glass B Okay, glass A You pour the cold water And then glass B you pour Hot water. Now, add a teaspoon of sugar in both glasses. And then, stir at the same time. Okay, stir both glasses at the same time. And then, observe the sugar in both water. Okay, remember, A is cold water, B hot water now. Let's observe the hot water and then this one is cold water. Ah, you still can see the sugar in cold water. Sugar is still visible. So the sugar does not dissolve. Okay, which one dissolves first? Okay. Mm, the water in hot uh, the sugar in hot water dissolve first. Now, let's see the cocoa powder. Okay. We put cocoa powder in cold water. And then the cocoa powder you put into hot water. Which one dissolves first? Okay, this is hot water. And then you stir. Okay, stir and after that observe which one dissolve first is it in hot water or in cold water see yes the cocoa powder has dissolved in hot water so the cocoa powder dissolve in hot water first Alright, so which water can dissolve sugar more quickly? So, hot water okay, can dissolve the sugar more quickly. So, sugar dissolves faster in hot water compared to cold water. As a conclusion, materials can dissolve more quickly in hot water than in cold water. Our second investigation is investigating the solubility of salt through stirring. Okay, melalui kacau adukan. Okay, you're going to investigate the solubility kelarutan uh, salt, okay, garam apabila awak mengaduk ataupun mengacau. Okay, which water can dissolve salt more quickly? Okay, which one more quickly dengan lebih cepat? Stir or without stir? Which one more quickly? Okay, now observing the solubility of stir salt. Okay, pour the same amount of water into glass A and glass B. And then, okay, put in the salt in both glasses. A teaspoon of salt in both glasses. And then, we only stir glass B. Okay, stir only glass B. 
and then observe the salt. Is it dissolved or not? See, ah, the salt has dissolved. Okay, in the glass that you have stirred. Meanwhile, glass A that you did not stir, the salt is still visible. Okay, it's still there. The salt is still there, so it does not dissolve. So, glass B dissolves first. Okay, why? Because it has been stirred. Now, let's look at um, the effect of stirring quickly and slowly. Okay, quickly dengan cepat, slowly dengan lambat. Okay, and then glass C, not stir. Okay, A, you uh, stir quickly. B, you stir slowly. And then C, do not stir. So, what is the effect? Okay, if you quickly stir the salt in glass A, and then slowly stir the salt in glass B. What is the effect? Which one dissolves first? Okay, which salt dissolves first? Is it quickly or is it you stir quickly or is it stir slowly? Now look at glass A. The salt has completely dissolved. And then glass B, you can see the salt still there. It has not completely dissolved. Okay, the salt is still visible. And then, in glass C, the salt also still visible. You can see the salt at the bottom of the glass. Alright, so which one is our first? Okay, the salt in glass A that you have stirred quickly. So, which water can dissolve salt more quickly? Okay, the water that you stir. Okay, the salt has dissolved quickly if you stir the water. So, the salt dissolves faster if stirred. As a conclusion, materials can dissolve faster in water if stirred. And then, one more thing. Okay, the materials can dissolve the fastest. Okay, the fastest if you stir it quickly. Okay, if you stir it quickly, the materials can dissolve the fastest. Alright. So now, let's do this exercise. Okay, activity book page 59. Okay, there are three cups here. Okay, cold water, water at room temperature. Okay, cold water ice jug, water at room temperature, air pada suhu bilik, and then hot water. And then add cocoa powder to each cup, stir the cocoa powder at the same time. Okay, and then uh, record the time taken for the cocoa powder to dissolve in each cup, the fastest, okay, fast or slow. Okay, which one the fastest? Okay, cocoa powder, the time for cocoa powder to dissolve in cold water is slow. Meanwhile, in hot water is the fastest. Okay, complete the table like this and then answer the questions. Okay, question number one. Cocoa powder dissolves the fastest in. Okay, mana yang lebih cepat fastest in? Okay, is it hot water or cold water or is it room temperature? Okay, you write down the answer and dissolve the slowest. Okay, mana yang paling lambat? Is it cold water, room temperature water or hot water? Then number two, materials can dissolve more quickly in. Okay, paling cepat more quickly in. Okay, which one is more quickly? Is it hot or in cold water? Okay, now. Um, activity book page 61 okay observing the solubility of stirred salt okay there are three beakers here at the same size and then stir the water in beaker a quickly and stir the water in beaker b slowly okay do it at the same time lift the water in beaker c without stirring okay c do not stir Observe the salt in each beaker. Record your observation in the table below. Okay, now let's see the table. Okay, time for salt to dissolve. Which one is the fastest? 
okay remember for uh beaker a just now you stir quickly and then beaker b stir slowly and then c without stirring okay do not stir okay tak kacau beaker c so which one um dissolve the fastest okay the salt in beaker a okay because it stirred quickly so the, the uh, salt in beaker a dissolve the fastest okay meanwhile the salt in beaker c dissolve the slowest okay very slow okay so what is the answer for the questions okay number one the salt in beaker which one dissolves slowly yes beaker c okay dissolves slowly because it is not stirred okay tidak dikacau okay the salt in beaker c did not stir okay other without stirring okay number two the salt in beaker which one dissolves the fastest okay beaker a okay good and then number three materials can dissolve faster in water if stirred okay very good if stirred sorry for the mistake okay thank you for listening and watching okay goodbye everyone